Hunters, welcome to another helping of Mr H's Art Pot. You join me today doing something I said I would never ever do again, and that's go back on building tools. However, my good lady wife has taught me into doing a bit of a foreigner for the in-laws. So here we are, back on the tools. Takes me back this. I'm just laying this flag here. When I used to be an apprentice, I remember floating these flags around a site, no trouble. And uh, old fella Norman Sherrington, God rest his soul, chap will be dead now. He said, as the years go on, they get heavier. I bloody know what he means now. Anyway, let's carry on tapping this down, shall we? I've still got it. This is where the flag cracks now. You see, there's more to me than just uh, sitting in the woods all day, eating food and all that carry on. You didn't know I could do this, you lot out there, did you? Right. I don't know, following on from Fertile Forms, eh? Right, what's the first one word? Cup of tea now. Diet Coke break. See, look at that, eh? Who needs rippling packs? Right, I've got my flags down. The idea is I'm going to put a shed here. Um, so what I'm doing, I'm building a bit of a foundation. I want to build some little brick piers. Down here. Luckily, I've got edge at foundation at house to build them on. I'm going to have to make my own on this side. Now, as you can see, we're not gifted with a lot of room, so it'll have to be done in piecemeal. These three will go in today, and I'll back move that alt spoil over there, and then build the other three in there. And then, hopefully, we can start building the shed, which is a wooden shed, it's not a brick shed. So, we'll have to see. But yeah, it's a uh, it's going okay, like I said, so I've still got it, even if it is a little bit sweaty. Anyway, I'll carry on with my, my diet coke break. We're now going to mix our mortar for our brick laying. Now it's very important that you put very liquid or some kind of uh, plasticizer into the mortar. Now why are you asking that dear YouTubers? I well, saw my travel stay clean when I'm laying the bricks. No, it's for to increase the workability of the mortar. So we just put a little spot in there. Give it a little shake. Shake, little shimmer. And we'll mix our mortar. They're doing me all labouring on this job as well, eh? That's that. Right, well, we'll get on, we'll mix this. And then uh, I'll show you right on the other bit, if I can remember. Right, I'm now building my little piers. Uh, like I said, I'm using original footings at house for this side, so those should definitely go nowhere. The Class B engineering bricks, these, for anybody who's uh, wondering what type of bricks they are. And they're a pig foot layer, especially if they get wet. What, what, what sort of bricks would start off back on trowel with her? But, we'll slowly get in there now. I've got two of them in, that one there and there's one behind me. So, uh, we'll get in there. My missus is obviously pushing, foreman, my missus, she's pushing this job on. She, I was just going to lay these and that was it I'd done for today. But uh, she said, no, we'll dig out and we'll get these other side in and get these pods in. So, there you go. Worst foreman I've had. Worst foreman. Right then, I'll get this other uh, course on and then hopefully we'll be stopping for dinner. I must admit though, the in-laws provide the best dinners, so I should be okay with that. I'll probably not be able to move and dig these holes out after, I'm too bloated. Anyway, crack on, onwards and upwards. Right, well we've got our uh, three little pods in on the other side. Mrs H has pushed the job on, wasn't taking no for an answer. So once those have set, I'll do the same thing as I've done on this side. 
build three piers on there. And as you can see at the back there, that metal uh, bar across, I'll put two more in. By that time, that, by that point even, those will be level. And then our floor will go on and that'll be a solid job. Should never shift after last a thousand years. What I will say is I pity the poor bugger who has to take them out. Probably be me, won't it, when we move in this house at some point. Right then, well I'm going to clean my tools up and uh, I'm going to get home and have a well deserved shower. So, until the next time, from myself and Mrs H, unfortunately the girls are not with us, I can't have dogs running around in here as well. It's bye bye for now. Working on the side.